And beautiful big titty butt naked women just don't fall out the sky, you know. Tell me how, you know. I been such a high and low. And I can tell you one thing. Beautiful big titty butt naked women just don't fall out the sky, you know. What up, YouTube? Your boy Jalen is back with another video. As you guys can tell from the title in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my sneaker collection. I have a crazy sneaker collection. I'm not going to lie to you guys. About 10 to 20 pairs. So I'm going to go ahead and showcase them to you guys. As you guys know, this is a men's health, wellness, fashion, and lifestyle channel. So it wouldn't be right if I didn't show y'all my my sneaker collection but before we get into it man make sure I hit that like button and subscribe down below turn that notification bell on so you're notified every time I upload a video because you guys aren't going to want to miss we are on the road to 100,000 subscribers so make sure you subscribe now so you can say you were here from the very beginning we got shoes from Balenciaga to Jordan to Dior whatever shoe you guys can think of I probably have in my collection so without further ado man I'm gonna stop talking let's go ahead and get straight into the video I get asked this a lot so in today's video I'm finna show y'all my entire sneaker collection we got more on the floor too but it is kind of crazy a lot of Balenciaga I'm not gonna lie let me drop this hold on drop the package down there it's a lot of shoes I'm not gonna lie and like I said this is something y'all always DM me whether it's comment on my videos or DM me over on Instagram what sneakers do you have your sneaker collection because like I told y'all I'm heavy into fashion and different things like that so I want to include y'all in it so y'all can see what type of sneakers I do have so we're gonna go ahead and start this video off so up first you guys we do have my most worn sneaker which is the Balenciaga tracks I love these shoes to death I'm not gonna lie to you guys these are like my everydayers bro I wear these whether I need to beat them up or just, you know what I'm saying, rock them out to like a dinner or something like that. I'm always wearing these. They're super comfortable. And despite the bulkiness, people say they're bulky, but to me, they're not really that bulky. I wear these a ton, like literally almost every single day. So at number one, we got the Balenciaga tracks. At number two, you guys, this is my most recent pickup, but I did pick up the Balenciaga 3XL sneakers. They grew on me. At first, I was like, what the fuck? What kind of shape is this? But these go crazy. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Like these, I'm going to actually throw these on today with the fit I got on and they're comfortable Balenciaga does a really good job of making a shoe that's different but also comfortable so I went ahead and got the white ones I like this cream and white color because I don't really have too many white sneakers in my collection and I definitely need to be more diverse because literally all I have is black shoes mostly is what you're gonna see in today's video but up next we do got the Balenciaga 3XL I know I'm OD with Balenciaga but we do got the Balenciaga stripe boots everybody needs a good pair of boots in their collection so i do have these right here check out the balenciaga branding at the bottom that's my favorite part these just go crazy you got the zipper accent as well really really nice pair of boots like i said i needed a pair and they're very durable and i really like how they have the distressing on it like i like how balenci has sneakers that look i guess worn i mean you're gonna wear your shoes anyway so why not you know what i'm saying buy them like that i guess i don't know it's very different really nice pair of sneakers uh, like I said, I am kind of OD on Balenci. We got a lot of Balenciagas, but that's what I've been rocking with recently. So right here, we do have the Balenciaga strike boots. We're just going to go ahead and get all the Balenciaga out the way. So next, we do have the Balenciaga multicolors. I know these blew up a while ago. I had them right before they did blow up, but I wear these around a lot. You can see a lot of wear and tear with these. Just an overall really, really nice shoe. And the colorway is pretty clean too. This is one of the lighter colorways I do have in my collection because I don't have too many. I'm not going to lie. I keep it simple. I wear a lot of black. You guys probably see in every video I'm probably wearing black. Uh, but we did go ahead and pick up these as well. Collection is crazy. I'm not going to lie to y'all. These are one of my favorites as well. So yeah, we do have the multicolors. Up next, I just actually got these in. It is the Rick Owen Vans type sneaker. I don't know exactly the name of these, but I did just get these in. I know they have the nylon pair, but I did get the leather pair. I actually haven't even put them on feet yet, but did pick these up. Loki, or maybe I might wear these today. I don't know. These look pretty good. I don't know, but I did go ahead and get these as well. Really nice sneaker, you know what I'm saying? Something subtle. I don't have Rick Highs, and I wanted something different, so I was like, let me go ahead and pick these up because they're really really nice let me know your guys thoughts about these as well also let me know your guys thoughts about the other sneakers in my collection as well i'm continuously finding different sneakers to pick up and trying to grow my collection so y'all give me y'all thoughts on these but yeah we do got the rico and lows right here next up we got the hype booster 3000s now i'm just fucking around we got we got the balenciaga defenders right here i know y'all know about these these are so big and bulky bro i'm like 6'3 originally these make me literally 6'6 i'm not even gonna lie to you guys but but 
nonetheless very very nice shoe another balenciaga pair like despite balenciaga's allegations and different things like that i promise you guys i don't support that i'm just buying items that i think look fly and look cool on me but they did create this shoe right here it is overall a really crazy shoe i'm not gonna lie balenciaga branding right there on the back as well but i get a lot of questions are they hard to walk in no they're actually pretty easy to walk in um but you know what I'm saying? I wear these around a lot. Different shoe. You got to have a different shoe in your collection. So we do got the Defenders up next. Next shoe, I just got these in. We got the Ameri Scale Top Lows right here. Let me know your guys' thoughts about these. Uh, Ameri Branding right there. I was skeptical about these. I've seen these everywhere. And I know they have multiple variations and colorways. But you know your boy had to go with the black. Because all I do is literally wear black. So we're going to try these out too. I haven't worn them yet. But they are a very cool colorway. I'm like, why not go ahead and pick these motherfuckers up? Because they overall really, really nice. And I feel like a lot of the shoes aren't hype beasts that I have. I feel like I'm very selective about what I wear because I do want to be comfortable. But I do also want to be able to wear them a lot. So that's why I always go with black. But yeah, we do got the Amiri Scale Top Lows up next. I guess you could call this next shoe one of my hype beast shoes. I know everybody has these. Uh, but we do have the Mesa Mihara Yasahiros. I think that's how you say it. Um, mine are pretty beat. I've had them for a minute now. I had them a long time ago. I'm not gonna lie But yeah, you got Mihara Brandy. I like that right there This is one of my favorite things about this shoe is just this little tag right here But really really clean shoe Giselle loves when I wear these I honestly don't know why everybody says they look like a melted converse But I do have these as well I should probably do more fit picks with a lot of these shoes now that I'm thinking about it I don't really be taking flicks like that so i probably should get more into that but we do got these miharas up next and then last but not least you guys this last pair of sneakers is 100 percent cooked but we do have the black cat air jordan fours i remember these were going crazy when they were released but now they shot up to like a grand on StockX or something crazy like that i don't know StockX be going crazy with the prices for shoes that are supposed to be real but we do got the black cats right here really really nice pair of jordan fours and this is honestly the only jordan i have in my collection i probably should get more i saw the black cat threes so i might go pick those up as well but uh yeah, this is the last shoe that i do have in my collection i got a pretty heat collection i'm not gonna lie to y'all so if y'all enjoyed the video man make sure i go ahead and hit the like button for your boy and subscribe down below turn that notification bell on so you're notified every time i upload a video because you guys aren't going to want to miss we're on the road to 100,000 subscribers i think we just hit 30k so y'all been going crazy with that subscribe button so you know i gotta keep dropping bangers so make sure y'all stay tuned for the next video man i really hope y'all enjoy man like i want to say again man i really do appreciate all y'all subscribing and supporting the kid on the channel man i really do like appreciate y'all because y'all are changing my life and allowing me to be able to follow my dreams of doing youtube so i fuck with y'all for that i really do appreciate y'all show some love on the gram as well i love y'all i'll catch y'all in the next video your boy is out peace